Welcome to the channel. Imagine creating high quality cinematic videos just by typing a description. Introducing Video Crafter, an open source AI model that pushes the boundaries of video generation. Today, we are not just talking about what it does, we are breaking down how it works, exploring its core features and diving deep into its code. Video Crafter is a state-of-the-art AI model designed for creating high-resolution videos directly from text prompts, images, or even existing video footage. Why it stands out? Unlike in many other text-to-video models, Video Crafter supports multiple use cases such as the video continuation, text-to-video, and image-to-video all in a single framework. It's open source, fully customizable, and delivers cinematic quality art uh, at a resolution of up to 1020 x 576 pixels. In this video, we will break down what makes Video Crafter unique, analyze its GitHub repository, and show you how you can generate your own AI videos in minutes. So what is Video Crafter? Developed by the AI Lab CBC team, Video Crafter is an advanced video synthesis model that leverages latent diffusion techniques. It expands upon existing text-to-image uh, text uh, architecture like stable diffusion and integrates temporal dynamics to handle the complexity of the videos. So what the key features, uh, features are. So it's multi-mode generation. Video Crafter supports not only text to video, but also image to video, where it can start be, uh, if with, uh, with a static image and wa watch it come to the life. For example, turn a, uh, a photo of a tree into a sequence showing the tree swaying in the wind. Okay, it also what's the temporal consistency uh, uh, inside this project. So unlike some models that generates uh, this joint that the frames, Video Crafter ensures smooth transition by refining how uh, latent states evolve over time. They are all pre-trained and ready to use. Okay, so the model is pre-trained on existing uh, datasets, so it works out of the box for most creative needs. So why it's revolutionary? Most videos generated tools require significant computational resources and data training, but the Video Crafter simplifies this with uh, pre-trained diffusion models that anyone can use. So let's talk about the repository structure. The GitHub repository is a neatly organized for both developers and enthusiasts. Okay, models hold pre-trained weight for talks like text-to-video and image-to-video. So configs contain settings for resolution, frame rate, and other parameters. And scripts, at the heart of the repository, where you'll find ready-to-use scripts for running and customizing the model. Okay, so let's talk about the core components of, of this GitHub project. So text to video pipeline, right? So the core pipeline in scripts text uh, to video.py allows you to generate videos from textual descriptions. Here's a quick snippet, okay? Um, this code initializes the pre-trained model, processes the text input and outputs a video file. Okay, so next would be latent space dynamics. The model uses latent, uh, uh, latent diffusion so, uh, to create video frames by interpolating between the embeddings of each frame. Um, okay, this ensures each frame connects seamlessly with the next. Temporal smoothing. Temporal smoothing aligns latent states over time, creating realistic motion and eliminating flicker. Uh, with the uh, customization options, okay, with the uh, configs pop folder, you can adjust frame rates, resolutions, and video length. For example, you can upscale to higher resolutions or experiment with the creative styles. Okay, after that, we can go and move on to the post processing. After generating the frames, the script compiles them into a video using tools like FFmpeg, uh, uh, okay, and then uh, after we finish with that, we can go and start using the whole thing. Right, so how to, how to start using it? Okay, so the, here are the setup instructions. Getting started, it's simple. Uh, clone the re repository and install the required dependencies. Okay, Ge for generating videos, run the text to video script with your prompt. Okay, and image to video example. If you want to start with an image, use the image to video script. 
After that, we can move on into the advanced customizations like fine-tuned model for you for your data using the provided training scripts or add new styles by modifying the latent diffusion architecture. Applications and real-world impacts of this application uh, can be very very wide ones. Okay, um, it's a very very wide range between from marketing, creating personalized video ads with a few lines of text to uh, to education or like generate animations for visual visualizing complex concepts. We can also use it as art and storytelling, bring imaginative ideas to life without expensive equipment or software. Uh, okay, because video crafters and open source developers um, uh, can uh, collaborate to improve its features, integrate uh, it into uh, other applications or create entirely new use cases. Video Crafter is um, a glimpse into the future of video creation. Its open source framework and advanced capabilities make it game changers for creators, developers and innovators. If this walkthrough inspired you, give this a thumbs up, subscribe to for more v uh, AI content and comment below. Uh, what's the uh, video you generated with the Video Crafter? Thanks for watching. Remember with Video Crafter, your imagination is the only limit.